In this video, I'll be sharing with you if the Yodel Club is worth joining, or if it's just another subscription service you're better off without. For as low as $8.25 a month, you get two Yodel cards every month if you join a Yodel Club. This sounds kind of too good to be true, so what's the catch? Well, first catch is that it's $8.25 is the discount you get if you pick the annual subscription and pay $99 per year. If you don't want to lock yourself in or maybe just want to try it out, the other option is pay monthly, but that would bring the price up to $9.99 per month. You do end up getting a pretty nice discount if you choose the annual plan. I'm happy to let you know that besides the price, there aren't any other differences between these two plans. So you don't have to worry if you choose the monthly plan that you'll be missing out on some extra benefits. So the second catch? Well, there's only a limited amount of cards to pick from. You can preview the cards available by checking this little box that says show me the Yodo Club cards only. This way you can see if the cards you're interested in are available. Once you're subscribed, your account will show two credits which you can pick any card that's available within the Yodo Club. I've already used my two credits for this month, but here is where you'll see credits available. Yodo says they're adding cards to the club all the time, but as of this video, there are 154 cards, which is still quite a large collection of cards to pick from. Of course, their full library of 478 cards is significantly larger. Hopefully one day, any cards can be selected. The club cards range anywhere from $3 to $13. So naturally, you get the most out of the club by using the credits on cards that are $9 and up, as each credit is essentially $5. So using a credit on a $12.99 card would essentially be getting 62% discount. And of course, it's a $5 per credit if you're using the monthly plan. It's about $4 some change if you do the annual plan. Of course, the credits will work on the lower price cards as well, ranging from $3 to $7. But that wouldn't make much sense to use your credits on that as you're only getting very little value or even losing value if you select a card that's cheaper than $5. Much more worth it to spend the credits on higher value cards. And just in case you're wondering, the credits can only be used on single cards and a couple digital cards, none of the packs. Another nice benefit of the Yoda Club is that after you select your cards to be shipped to you, you can start listening to cards immediately. You don't even need the cards to physically arrive yet. The cards you order will show up in your library in the Yoda app, which allows you to play the card from the app to the player, or you can temporarily place the card into a make your own card so your child can easily access the content. The cards are shipped in this brown envelope and as far as I know it's USPS first class so there's no real tracking available as it's treated more like regular letters and not packages. Shipping time varies but I received my cards in about two days. The cards aren't shipped just like this they actually come with a nice little packaging which I assume is for when they put these in retail stores. There are two other perks that I found that make the Yodo Club a pretty much must-have and that's free shipping regardless of the price. If you're not in the Yoda Club, you would need to spend $50 or more before you get free shipping. This is huge as the biggest reason I didn't want to purchase anything from Yodo's website is that the cost is about $10 to ship. So buying at $8.99 would mean you're paying more just to ship it. Meaning that even if the Yodo card you want isn't available in the Yodo Club, it still makes sense to join the club just for the free shipping alone. Instead of paying for shipping and getting one Yodo card, you end up with three Yodo cards for the same price. In addition to free shipping, you also get 10% off everything you order, including cards that are on sale or packs that are on sale. 10% might not seem like a lot, but if you end up purchasing a lot of cards, it adds up pretty quickly. If you already decided to enter the Yodo ecosystem, the Yodo Club makes a lot of sense to join, especially in the beginning when you want to build up a nice collection. You can cancel at any time, so if you think that going with the annual plan and 24 cards is too much, you can always select the monthly plan and cancel once you feel like your collection is a good place and join again later if you want to grow it again. Personally, I find that the Yodo Club is a pretty big game changer in the screenless audio industry. For $10 a month, you're able to steadily grow your child's listening library. Now, if only other companies did this, I'm looking at you, Tony. Anyhow, it just makes sense for anyone who owns a Yodo Player or Yodo Mini to join the club. While yes, you might still be able to get better value from the make your own card by making your own content, but you still need to purchase those cards first, and shipping really kills the deal on those. Even if you're planning to mainly use the make your own cards, you probably should join the club for at least a month. If you plan to buy this pack here, it costs $14.99 for 5 make your own cards, and it costs $10 shipping, which means you're paying $24.99 total. Or instead, you could spend $10 to join the club, get 2 credits for 2 cards, 
free shipping for this five pack and save 10%, making it $13.49. In total, you'd spend $23.49 and you're not only paying less, but you're getting two additional Yodo cards. You might be thinking, well, why don't I just buy these five pack of cards off of Amazon? Well, unfortunately, they do not have these on Amazon, so you can't buy them from there. They only have it on their own website and a few select websites. I haven't used any of these websites before, so I'm not sure if they offer free shipping. If you found this video helpful, I'd be grateful if you subscribe, as that would mean a lot to me, and it would really help the channel grow and hopefully help others find their way to this video. If you're still not sure about the Yodo Mini, go ahead and check out this video over here as I have an in-depth review about it and talk about all the pros and cons. And I'll see you in the next one.